Marina Sabalenka found an extra source of energy as she battled back to defeat British No. 1 Katie Volter in Beijing. Marina Sabalenka found an unusual way to get a boost during her win over Katie Volter in Beijing. The Brit pushed the world number one in two close sets before Sabalenka came through 7, 5, 7, 6, 2, after chugging some Pepsi during the match. Sabalenka had to battle back to defeat British number one Bolter at the China Open on Tuesday, coming through in two and a half hours. The world number 56 served for both sets but was unable to win either of them as the top seed kicked into another gear and refused to lose. The 25-year-old was also helped by a can of Pepsi as she chugged the drink throughout the match for some extra energy. It proved successful as she battled back from a breakdown twice in the match. To celebrate her hard-fought victory, Sabalenka took another swig before her on-court interview. And the world number one was full of praise for top-ranked Brit Bolter, who had come through qualifying to reach the main draw in Beijing. I mean, it's always great battles against Katie, the Australian Open champion said. She's really an incredible player. Super happy that I won this match. It was really tough, it was a tough match. I don't know, I just tried to stay focused and I just tried to put as many balls in as I can. While Pepsi appears to be Sabalenka's drink of choice on the court. The world number one recently struck up a partnership with Maestro Doble Tequila, one of the brands that also sponsors the US Open and the Belarusian admitted that she would be having a drink after narrowly missing out on the title in Flushing Meadows, losing to Coco Gauff in the final. Following the defeat, Sabalenka said, I am definitely going for a drink tonight, if I am allowed to say that. Yes, we are athletes, but sometimes we are drinking, but not much. The 25-year-old became number one in the world for the first time following the US Open meaning she still had something to celebrate. And she will be hoping to end the week in Beijing with another celebratory toast if she can win her 14th career title. After beating Bolter, she will now face Jasmine Paolini for a spot in the quarterfinal.